Speaking. Please excuse the interruption. Students, remain in your seat until the bell has rung. And no going in the halls without a hall pass. you? Yes, I remember. You used to work here. How are you? Alive. Hmm? Barb? Oh. Barb says you're looking for your co-workers. Catnap wouldn't like that you're here. You should leave. For your own safety.
not a good listener, are you? You're a lot like the other humans in that way. I wonder if your screams will sound like theirs, too. <laughs> I look forward to finding out. Hello, students. Find my sisters and I to learn facts across a variety of subjects. Press my button to hear some facts on anatomy. Wanna try hopping to the moon with me?
chubby bear hug. Wanna know how much I love you? <laughs> Oh, my God.
You, you're a Pappy's angel. Come to save us. Nothing left to save. Not here. Bird cat maps from the angel. There, home. A million pairs of eyes are on you now. Watching, waiting, hungry. They want nothing more than to crawl beneath your skin and eat away at you bit by little bit. <laughs> Fill what feels empty inside themselves. That thing, Catnap, the prototype is his god, and this is what he does to heretics. These little toys follow Catnap to avoid that very fate, and in return, they are fed. <clears throat> we try to fight it. The prototypes control. I am the last of the smiling critters. Listen to me. You need to get out of this place. You need to live. You and Poppy could fix this. End this madness. The torments. Oh no. Oh no. Leave me. Please. Just go! Run!
is for all Playtime Company employees. At 11.01 a.m. Eastern Standard Time, an unknown hostile force was declared present within the Playtime Company facility. Personnel are to begin enacting emergency evacuation protocols immediately. Leave all personal belongings. Do not engage with any hostile individuals. If no exit path is available, seek shelter in a hidden location. Use blankets or pillows to cover your body, and remain silent. Do not look through any windows. Do not open doors for any individuals. Do not make eye contact.
then. Come on in. Please have a seat. How was your ride down? It was uh, nothing like we were expecting. Uh, Mr. Ludwig's speech was, well, it just confirms for us that you're the orphanage we want to go through. It's a truly magical place. I felt right at home from the second I entered. You open that door the first time and you just know you're never going to leave. Kind of like finding a home as a child and always thinking of it when you want to feel comforted. <clears throat> I understand you want to give Jeremy that home. Yes, and we would like to adopt. Ah, amazing. You'll be perfect for... Oh. What? Well, it appears there's been some complications. Complications? What kind of complications? I... I don't know. Um, the form says... testing. <laughs> what does that mean? Tell us, what does that mean? Miss Graper, we deserve a better explanation than that. Don't you think? You're in charge of all this! How could you not know? And why are we only finding out about this now? I... I don't. I'm sorry.
see why we have to end this? You don't.